Welcome back to Let's Play Narnia, The Lion, the Witch and the Wardrobe. This is part 11 and this part we're doing Follow Aslan. You have a traitor in your midst, Aslan. His offense was not against you. Aslan knows that unless I have blood as the law demands, all of Narnia will be overturned and perish in fire and water. That boy will die on the stone table. Enough. I shall talk with you alone. So just as the level is named, we're actually going to follow, basically follow Aslan and see what he's going to do. And uh, we're going to use a lot of the pan pipes and making people fall asleep this part, but that's okay. So what you want to do here is that you actually just want to destroy this. And under there is the place where you can use the pan pipes to destroy that. Use the pan pipes and then make the centaur fall asleep. Because if he actually caught, uh, gets you and courts you, he's going to tell you that it's too late wandering all these goats. Uh, something annoying is that I actually failed uh, one time, and that's because of Lucy actually. So I think I went back. I think, I think this, I think I failed one time. Yeah, I think I failed here. Uh, I might have done. I think I did. Something like that. But that was because of Lucy, I think, or not, or just my own making, because I just waited. Yeah, I did. I waited because he, I thought he was too far away, and that he wouldn't fall asleep if I did it when he was that far away. So I did it after a while, and then he caught me, which was quite annoying. I think... I can't remember, but I think it's another fail I do, but I think that's because of Lucy. I don't know. I hope there's no more fails, but you can never be sure, eh? Because I can't remember a thing. I got very bad remember, 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 yeah, I do. But yeah, keep on going. You can see Aslan in front of us. He's going, and we need to follow him and see what he's going to do. Because he can't do something without us knowing what he's going to do. Let's destroy this. Again, there's they are always under those. Destroy it, and then you can make the sand door fall asleep. And he's asleep. That's great. I don't think I feel anymore. I don't think so. Hopefully not. Just going to go up here and see if we can find some more coins and like shields. Yeah, one shield. That's two out of twelve. That's not very good. So what you want to do here is that this is something that we um, haven't done before in this level. So you're just going to you have to wait for the sun doors to uh, run and get out of the way, and then you're just going to shoot arrows at the tent. And the fawn doesn't even see it, which is something very strange. And then he's going to check what is up because it closed itself. And then we can get past, like so. And it's not going to notice you at all, actually. There we can see Athan going into the woods. I wonder what he's doing. We will see 
at the end of this part. Yeah, actually, I think I failed here. Might have done. Or not. Uh, yes, I actually think I do. Because Lucy got caught by the light just over here, which was really annoying. She did. I think... I think she did. Or no, she didn't. That's great. I didn't fail. That's great. So, yeah, here are some enemies. These dwarves and these other uh, weird creatures. Um, what you want to do is that you want to get Lucy. I just use the ghoul tame. Oh, they're called ghouls. That's great. I haven't noticed it before now. That's really strange. So, yeah, just defeat some of them because they're quite annoying. We don't want them to... Uh, bug us and you're going to go over here and then just get this rock to fall down and we're going to use it as a bridge to get over to those other dwarves and over there is a giant and we can't get past the giant so what we're actually going to do is that we're going to make the giant fall asleep which is very clever and that is actually what we're going to do so kill the ghouls first before you try to use the pan pipes because they will just destroy it and be really annoying so make the troll fall asleep so now we come to this part where there's one more enemy that we haven't seen before it's a werewolf and you can actually see him up there. There you can see him. He's just howling and stuff. They're really, really annoying. So yeah, you're actually going to use the fire arrows to get this bush, these bushes away so you can get past. But these werewolves have a special attack. They just start howling and if you like get caught by the howling or whatever like that like that it will just knock you away and it's so so annoying and they just slap you as well which is really annoying as well so i'm just going to do the go time and try to kill some of those werewolves because they're really they're really really annoying they're one of the most annoying enemies they for me they are now there's just one werewolf, so we can get past. Get those bushes away. One more of the bushes to get. And you have to go back every time because the fire arrows won't um, be there enough for both or for two bushes. And you can see there's a timer by when the giant is going to wake up in two and a half minutes. And what we're going to do now is that we're go just going to defeat the enemies and then we're going to climb up through the trees. So you have to defeat them all. But I'm just going to get these statues. And that's 5 out of 5. You can you can try to make them all sleep if you want, but I... Um, yeah, it's because of the howling I can't do it, so it's really annoying. Thank god we got the Susie, Lu Susie, Lucy here because she replenishes our health. Which we really need. And use the arrows if you are able to it as well because they take away more health. Oh my god, these enemies are so annoying. Like, super annoying. Oh, take out the wolf. Take it out. The werewolf, I mean. Take them out. Take them out. Yeah, like that. And then I'm just going to stand here and shoot at all the enemies that come. When the camera moves like that, it means that it's the enemy just um, um, outside the camera. And if you actually do that with the pan pipes, you will just get a shield. And now we can hide in the trees and then we're going to watch a cutscene. Him. 
What G just said is that it's going to be a war. So the next level is the first war level. I remember when I was a kid, I, I thought that the White Witch was like the best thing. I actually had her, her spear, the one that she turns everyone into statues. I actually have that yet. It's like a plastic prop thing. It's really fun to have as well. I really liked it and I thought she was like the best thing ever. I loved her hair. But it's not really good but yeah we got really a very good as a rating so i'm going to see you in the next part for war